Today, let's talk about the state of your eyes while driving and also your hearing, how you can hear very well, what you can hear. They are going to test it, especially eyes. That is what we are doing today. So if you have been following me, you will have seen a lot of videos that I have done. Watch it in case you need it. It's in English and they are, all the questions are in French. Just watch it. Take a look at it. Then you can start be answering questions. It's most easier, easier done like that rather than just going direct to a question. So we are going to talk about how the eyes, what you need what percentage the highest must, clear, must clearly see and the, your hearing capacity before you can start driving. Thank you and let's go to the class. We are talking about la vue et le lui. Leo, it means the eyesight and the hearing. These two are very important when driving on the road. The eyesight is very important for the driver to be able to see what is going on around him. And the hearing is very important as well. And it also gives him additional information to the driver. It helps him also. Then we'll go to the A part, la vue, which is the eyesight. To get a permit can do it. We know we have permit A, that is those people that are driving motorcycle, and permit B, those are the people that are driving the vehicle. They, it is important for them to have a good eyesight. And in the exam, take note, the minimum, the minimum eyesight that they should have is 5 over 10 for the two eyes. But in case, if one eye is 1 over 10, that means the second eye must be 6 over 10. It must not be 5, it must be 6. That is what they are saying, they are talking about. That is, the first eye must be 5 over 10 and the other one must be 5 over 10. But in case, if the other one is just 1 over 10, then the second one must be 6 over 10. That is, it must see clearly than the other one. That, it, that shows that it gives the guarantee that the driver can see. But in case, if the person cannot have 5 over 10, what is going to do it, it must have either glasses or eyes contacts in order to be able to drive. And in case if they are using glasses, or eyes contact, it must be mentioned, mentioned in the driving license. Because if the police control them and cannot find it in there, that means they are liable or there is accident, they cannot see that they have the right to use their glasses and they are not using it during the accident, that means they are at fault. So they have, it must, it is very important. And to be, to be able to ascertain that they have it, they must have extra glasses and extra eye contact always in their car while, they, while driving. It's very important because when police control, they have to be able to prove that they can read the panel. You can be able to read the panel. You can be able to see what is going on far away from you. Then we can now go to the tie of the panel adapter. What are the how how can they be able to read? What can you be able to see with your eyes? So we are going to talk about the panel now. The panel first, you know, surely everybody knows that the color of the panel you can be able to see it. And if you have a good eyes, you must be able to see it from five hundred meter ahead of you. That is for the panel. And the how I how tall the panel is and what they wrote inside it. When you are in the city, you can be able to see what they write in a panel at 50 meter. And when you are outside city, it must be 150 meter. Then we we'll go to the, the hearing part, which is the Louis. When you, when you, the hearing part is that no, the driver is not hearing, he's not allowed to drive. 
that is one thing you must be able to hear what is going on around you because if you do not hear how are you going to hear when somebody press on or how are you going to know when there is problem with your tire or when you when the when the brake is not working very well how are you going to know or when there is vehicle priority vehicle that is coming like a hospital vehicle that is blowing their siren how are you going to know if you don't have a good year so you must be able to you must have a good year and the driver must not put a music that is very very high in the vehicle while driving because with that it will not help you to be able to know what is going on around you so while driving it is on tardy it is not good it is prohibited when you are driving or you wear um earpiece while driving no it will not help you so it is untidy it is not allowed and thank you see you in my next class